Hey guys, it's KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play of the Forest. <clears throat> this is version 0 0.06, we're on season 2, and this is part 2, and I'm gonna go ahead and skip the cutscene. Uh, the beginning of this game is very weird, where it messes with fraps a lot, so I'm gonna have to see where I wanna be starting these Let's Plays at. But, uh, here we are. We just crashed. Now, for those of you who watched part 1, uh, I apologize for my noobness, um... <clears throat> I basically just spent part one running around aimlessly, not knowing, you know, what to do or where I was going. And this time we're going to actually try and build a base. And this time we are going to try and stay away from the maniac, killer, native cannibals. You know, pro tip, right? Now, I'm not sure what the deal is with this uh, phone thing, but I'm just going to leave it alone for now. And let's uh, get started. First thing we're going to do is look around. It looks like we got some time to loot. So let's see if we can find some loot. What we're looking for here is these things, first of all. And we're going to look for luggage. Ooh, I don't see a lot of luggage, though. Hmm. Alright, let's get whatever luggage we can. There we go. And what we what we get out of the luggage that is really nice is uh, cloth. And cloth is going to be used for Molotov cocktails, which are a one-hit kill on the natives. And uh, unfortunately, I don't see a lot of luggage. And the natives might be coming around to check this place, so we should probably get out of here. Now, which way do I want to go? I have no clue. Let's head, uh, I don't know. Let's head this way. We will pick up some, oh, here we go. Here we go, another one. Okay. We will pick up sticks and stones along the way. Oh, more luggage. Flashlight. All right, how about those sticks? not sure how many sticks I can hold. It's kind of annoying with rocks, at least. If you pick up too many rocks, you put your axe away. Oh, okay. I know where I am now. Okay. Now, this is more like it. So, I'm going to show you my favorite place to build. Maybe I should build in another spot. Eh. You know what? Just for this Let's Play, since I failed so, so bad last time, I'm going to go build where I... Unless they've changed the game, I'm going to go build in a spot where I know will be a good spot to build in. Again, they could have changed stuff, and they, they probably did, but uh, I'm going to go with what I know for now. Alright, we've got a thunderstorm, and here is my spot. So this is where I usually build. Um, I've built here in the past, during Season 1. Uh, there's lots of rocks, there's lots of stuff to build with. Um, when I used to build here, the, the cannibals weren't coming out here, so we'll see how that goes. Alright, so let's press B and take a look at our at our first shelter and we're gonna go ahead and make the hunting shelter and we are going to turn it this way um, let me go down here oops I didn't want to place it there but that's okay that'll be good enough let's go ahead and build as much as we can all right so now we need uh, we need rocks and we need uh, logs now oh my goodness lag I don't know what that was anyway uh, yeah, so basically what we're going to do is we're going to build a shelter and... Oh, Jesus, already? Leave me alone. Already? Unbelievable. I guess it's not a safe spot anymore. Oh, my goodness. Just brutal. Now we got to try and make it out of this place. Do I still have my axe? I do. It's nice that, that, that they don't take your weapon. Now I have no idea where to go now. Oh my god, I got I got nothing. I, I need energy, I need food, I need drink, I need Molotovs. I should have made these Molotovs earlier. By the way, the way you make Molotovs, in case you didn't watch the last episode, is just right click on the booze, and then right click on the, uh, the cloth. And then right click on the combine button. Oh man. I do not like this tunnel system. Uh, it's unbelievably scary. Let's put that away. No, that's where I came from, wasn't it? Oh, there's some guys over there. We want to stay away from them. I can't see. How do I get by them? 
Really? They saw me already? Maybe I was supposed to go around this side. What's up here? Ooh, what's this? Oh, maybe this is the way out. Probably not. Alright, I'm gonna have my, my lighter out. It's probably not a good idea to have it out. But just for the sake of, like, letting you guys see what's going on. Oh, look at this. What the hell? Are you kidding me? He, does he have a cell phone jammed in his mouth? And an iPad in his throat? Slash chest? Oh my god. This is just hideous. Hmm. And their intestines in a suitcase. Okay. Yeah, I'm not freaked out at all. What's these guys' problem, man? Why do they gotta be killing people? Like, seriously. Wait, your mommy didn't give you enough love as a child? I mean, what the hell? Jesus. Alright, now let's look at our inventory and see if we got anything else for health. Uh, what are these? Marigold can be used in crafting? I'm not sure what that's for. What's this? Doesn't look like that's anything. Booze can be used in crafting. Oh, we do have some meds. Okay. Alright, well. Oh. Are those all cans of soda? What are those? Can't tell. It might just be all booze. Alright, let's see if we can get out of here. I do not like these caves. Alright, you know what? I'm going with the Molotov. Now, the problem with the Molotovs is once you take them out, if you try and put them back, you'll just drop them on yourself and hurt yourself. Can I take that? How do I... Okay, hold on. I'm going to try and do this. Yeah, see? You hurt yourself whenever you do that. Oh, my goodness. Now, can I take this? I want to take this helmet. I guess not. Why can't I pick up that helmet? That would be pretty useful. Yeah, they should let you put away the Molotovs. I do not like the way you can't put away the Molotovs. You just drop them on yourself and hurt yourself. Like, that's kind of weird. Oh boy, hold on. Really? That's... That's the only one I had. I thought I had a few Molotovs. It looks like I had three of them. Man, I am just not doing too good at this. Let's get another one started right away. Because this is just poor. Okay, here we are again. Let's start this over. Now, I don't know if I went in a bad place. Uh, I don't know where the cannibals are more likely to attack. I, I don't know where to build, basically. It's just a crapshoot. And, um, yeah, it's kind of annoying, so... I'm gonna try and find a better spot this time. I mean, I didn't. I have. I was there for like a minute before cannibals were all over me. So I don't know if I should try the same spot again now. That's the thing. Do I try the same spot again? Really? What's this used for? What's the phone used for? Uh, Twenty degrees Celsius. Yeah. It doesn't seem to be. Calories, yeah, it doesn't seem to be telling me too much. The phone, um, I can block too. I forgot about that. You can right click the block, so maybe I'll try that. I just don't like the way they found me so fast, like the first day. I had like no time, you know, like they shouldn't come out until the first night. Might have to watch some videos on this to figure it out. I really don't want to have to, though. Um, Okay, so that's villages over there, so let's head this way. 
stupid ball. I don't know why they have the ball there. Alright, so let's, um... Take some pills. So I have no idea where I should be building. Like, I don't know if there's any, like, you know, trick. You know? Like, oh, this is a good place to build. Or, oh, this is a, this is a bad place to build. Uh, now, as a person who does YouTube videos and streams, like, you know, most of the week, uh, I really don't have a lot of time to be searching out videos, but I might have to, because I do want to do well in this game. It does seem like a fun game. I just, uh, I kind of wish the game would explain to me what's going on instead of me having to go look for outside uh, sources. Like, I have no idea where I should be building. Um, I guess I could just build right here. Yeah. Why not? Just build right here. Uh, <laughs> I have no idea where I'm supposed to be building. I do know the first thing I need to build is a hunting shelter so I can actually start saving. You know, actually... Can I... Let's go up here. Hmm. Nah, I like down here better. Can't make up my mind. Whatever. Just build a freaking thing. Let's, let's get this show on the road. Alright, the first thing that's going to be the most... The hardest thing to get is going to be logs. So we're going to go ahead and cut down some big-ass trees right now. Actually, this might be a longer episode too because I can't... Uh, I can't stop the video until I save the game. Well, I mean, I guess I could. I just, you know, I can't turn off the game then. <laughs> um. Oh, the logs are in the trees. Awesome. Well, at least they all fell right by the, the campsite. Now, the thing that used to suck about saving was uh, when, I, when I was playing the game, um, if you save the game, it would turn day to night. And uh, according to the patch notes, that's now changed. You can save it out turning day to night. And that's what I really want to do. I want to see how that works. And I don't know if you could push the trees anymore. You used to be able to push the trees, kind of angle them where you want them to fall. So I'll try that too. Mm, oh yeah, you can still do it. Very nice. Next thing I'm going to do is make some Molotovs. Actually, I should have done that first. Let's go ahead and make some Molotovs. Going into your bag does not pause the game like I thought it might have. So that's a good tip. <laughs> okay. They have no fast way to switch your gear, which I wish there would be some kind of faster way. To switch what you're holding to make combat a little easier. Maybe they'll maybe they'll put that in the game. Maybe not. I don't know. Maybe they want it to be more realistic. Um, I don't know, but I kind of ho I kind of hope they put in a, a quicker way to switch out your what you're holding. All right. Need some sticks, some rocks, and we're gonna need one more log. Oh, or not? No, we don't need any more logs. We just need more sticks and rocks. Good, 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 good. Probably isn't a good place to build. It seems like there's never a good place to build. Wherever I build, they always find me. But we'll see what we can do. One more stone. Ah, oh, come on, where's the stones? I probably have run past a few stones. The game's intense. I'm just trying to keep a lookout, you know? Okay, now we should be able to save. Sleep here to fill energy and save game. Follow home icon and find my way back. Okay, well, how do I do that? Z? Well, it made it nighttime again. What's C? Oh, C was to save. Oh, no. Oh, I messed that one up. 
Well, that's my own fault. I didn't pay attention. Okay, so C is to save and Z is to go to sleep. Oh, this is going to be a horrible video for you guys now. Because it's going to be so dark. I'll try and get some lights going. Alright. Uh, we need a fire. Uh, we will do a standing fire. Um, and we'll do one right here. And we don't have enough stones. It's much easier to spot the stones and stuff at night. Which is pretty cool. Oh, Jesus. They're already here! Did they run away? Where are they? How did they even know I was here? It, it looked like they were running at me, but now I don't see them. Ugh. Well, at least next time I know to hit C to save. And at least you guys can see now. Although, I can't build or do anything. Ooh, it looks like my my um, stamina bar is purple. So I guess being cold does matter now. The problem is if I drop this thing... In order for me to do anything, I'm going to have to drop this thing. Oh, really? And now I have the other one, too. It just automatically picked it up. Why can't I take that out of my hand? Ugh. That's frustrating. I really wish they would fix that. There we go. Alright, now at least you guys can see. Although it's probably for the worst, because now they're going to be able to spot me. But honestly, I don't care. Let's see if we could sleep again and change it to day. Oh, sleeping changes to day. Okay. Alright, great. Well, that's good at least. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, collect some more stuff. We need to make some more standing fires. What I'm going to do is I'm going to try and make um, a bunch of standing... Let's kill this guy. Take his meat. And you can use their skin for leather armor. Actually, let's get this guy too. Alright, there, I have a little other armor now. Now, armor works as, like, a barrier that it's, like, they will break all the, the leather armor away from you, and then you will, uh, you'll be vulnerable, but you won't take, you won't take damage until then. Now, where do I want to put my next fire? Now, these fires will fend them off a little bit, so that's why we're putting these up. A little bit of, a uh, deterrent. It's not going to stop them completely, but, um, they'll think twice about coming in. It's the first defense we can have. Alright, the, the thing I don't like about this spot is I don't seem to have a lot of stones. Yeah, I do not have a lot of stones in the area. Unless I'm just running over them, which is, you know, probably the case. So, what I want them to do with this game is I want them to make daytime safer. Uh, I want to be able to, like, move around during the daytime a little bit safer and not have to worry about getting jumped, like, every two seconds. That would be nice. Unless I'm just playing the game wrong, which, you know, is very much the possibility. There's not enough stones around here. That's going to be a problem. We just got to walk a little slower. I gotta be quiet because I gotta hear them like if they're trying to run up on me. Can I take more of these? How many how many of those can I take? I have three of them already. Alright, well let's go ahead and try the save feature now. Okay. Alright, we just saved the game. Sweet. Okay. That's pretty cool. I do like that uh update. Oh wait a minute. Oh here it is. Okay. There we go. Okay. Let's see what else we can make here. Maybe a trap. A trap might be nice. This one's more expensive and it takes rocks. Uh, deadfall trap? I like the deadfall trap, personally. And we will put it right there. 
and now we just need some logs. The thing I like about the deadfall trap is it doesn't take stones. <laughs> That's what I really like about the deadfall trap. I can't carry any more sticks. be a good fall right there. I don't like coming over here because this is where I saw them, but we won't be over there for long, so. Oh, another part of the updates is you can now set off your own traps. So you gotta be careful. I gotta be careful about that. I can't walk over there. I'll just drop this one right here. Okay. And now what? More standing fires? I don't know. Let's see. Let's see, we should probably make a fire on the ground for cooking. Um, you can make this cheap fire, but I usually like to make the fire pit. I'm going to make the basic fire, though, just because uh, the fire pit costs a little bit much. Right there's a good spot. Okay. Drop this thing again. Alright, I'll show you guys how to eat. If you come over to the fire and take one of these lizards and press C, you'll put them on the fire and start cooking them. Now you have to sit here and watch it because uh, once it's done cooking, you'll have to like eat it right away. You can't just walk away and get it at your leisure. So let's see. Come on. Come on. Gotta be almost done by now. There we go. And that should be E. And there we go. And now my hunger is all the way up. Okay, so that's pretty good. Alright. Uh, we got a couple fires up. We got a couple other things. Let's... Let's, um... Let's go ahead and make a wall. Yeah, let's just make a basic wall. I'm not sure what the, what the difference is between the walls. But uh, we're going to go ahead and make a basic wall. And uh, where do we want to put this? Let's, um... It looks like they came from this side. So let's, uh, let's try and protect ourselves over here. Alright. R. Eh, that should be pretty good. Alright. So that's just going to be logs. So let's go ahead and get ourselves some more logs. Actually, before we do anything else, save. I'm a save-aholic. If any of you guys have ever watched my Fallout 3 stuff, you'll know I like to save a lot. So, Alright, so I was under the misconception that the thing on the right-hand side is a thirst meter. Um, it's not a thirst meter. At least I don't think it is. I think it's an energy meter. So I think I was wrong about that because it kept going up when I first started playing. Anytime I drank anything... Oh boy, I just set myself on fire. That's gonna eat away all my uh That's gonna eat away all my um armor. You can see now all my you can see now all my armor's gone. Try and get some more. Okay, there's a wall. Alright, we're coming along, coming along. Uh, let's build another wall right next to it. Let's um Oh, they're supposed to snap into place. Wait, do walls not snap into place anymore? Hey. Huh. Walls are supposed to snap into place, and they don't seem to be doing it. So, that's a bit annoying. Oh, see? I can trash it? Okay. So I think I could take down that ghost wall I just put down. If I wanted to. By the way, if you hear me getting quiet, it's because I think I'm hearing stuff. Or it's because I am hearing stuff.
that's why they don't they don't bother letting you get water out of the ocean or any or not the ocean but even like the rivers and stuff because there's no point to it there's no thirst meter so and i hate going so far I hear something. Oh, freaking fire. I walked over the, the fire on the ground. Damn it. Oh, look at all the water on the... Oh, look at this. It's like I'm in a little bit of water. That's pretty neat. Let's go see. Let's save. Okay. All right, um, oh, Jesus. I don't know what to do here. I don't know if I should def be defensive or try and kill him or what. I didn't think they'd come from the side. I don't know what to do. I don't know if I should attack him or not. What are they doing? I'm not the best uh, judge at throwing Molotov, so I, wanna, I don't want to throw it until they come down here. What's their freaking problem? Well, they're on fire now. And one for you. Oh, that went too far. Wait, why aren't they dying? Okay, I'm not sure what's going on. I think the game might be bugged. What we're going to do here is we are going to go ahead and make a standing fire. Like, right about here. And we don't have the stones. They didn't even die, man. They're not doing anything. Oh, here they go. So you can use these standing fires against them. I'm kind of pissed off that my, uh, my Molotov didn't kill him. So what we can do with this, these guys is make an effigy. So we're way past our time here, but I'm going to actually see if I can get an effigy going. Uh, where's the effigy? Effigy. Here we go. Oh, uh, I can't... It won't even let me pick it? Wait. Effigies. Why won't it let me pick it? Maybe because I don't have anything. Maybe I need the sticks. Oh. Oh, come on! You're alive?! You better be dead. Yeah, she's dead. Okay, maybe we need the sticks to get it started. We're gonna need stones as well. Man, this isn't good. So yeah, the effigy supp- Oh, I almost set that off. So the effigy's supposed to like scare them or something? I don't know. Let's see if we can put one up here. Right where we kill them. Okay, so let's go grab some more body parts. Oh man, the body parts all disappeared. Nope, here's some. Damn it, where'd the body parts go? Oh, I think I lost the body parts I'm gonna need. Yeah. Damn it. There's an arm. 
I didn't think I dismembered the one, the lady. Oh, there she is. Okay, good. I didn't dismember her. I don't know how long she'll stay there, though. I don't think we're going to have enough, because I don't think we're going to have enough heads. Yeah, we don't have enough heads. Damn it. We're one head short. I could go looking for one. Oh, we're an arm short, too. See, I think when you dismember them, their parts go away pretty quickly. I'm thinking. Honestly, I really don't know. All right. Well, we're just we're just gonna stack the defenses up over here, as much as we can. Uh, you could tell that those um those fires really kept them in check. It made them much more manageable, and I was able to fight them. As a matter of fact, I should probably save the game. Yeah, if you use those fires as a barrier, they make them. All, it makes it a lot more easier to handle them. Oh, there's not enough stones over here. That's a problem. Again, I might be missing them. Should put the stuff down. I think you get leaves out of that. Alright, there's a stone. Alright, I'm going to finish this last fire. This video is going on way too long. So I'm going to finish this fire. Now, I don't know if the... um, I have no idea if the save states are working. But, uh, you know, if I come back and the save states are working, we'll start this up where we left off. Uh, and if they're not, we'll uh, we'll have to start over. So that's going to be it for part two. We'll see you next time for part three. Till then, take it easy.